Hi guys, it's Lita. So I have another unboxing for you guys. I have a Crypto Carrion Parcel of Terror for you guys. As you can see, it's open. And if you subscribe to this channel, you know I do blind unboxings all the time. However, my SD card has failed me once again so this and my other video the fright crate january unboxing were unplaybackable is what my sd card told me or my camera told me my canon so no initial reactions on this one guys my sd card's bad because it's not my fault for damn sure um, and yeah, I'm just gonna get into this box for you guys, but I, um, really loved it. Um, so yeah, we'll just, you know, wander on into this. Um, so the first thing, which is not really the first thing, is this amazing Cthulhu print, which has like coordinates on it, which I kind of want to look up. And it's by Schlitzies, and it's just awesome. This this is such a great print i appreciate all of the crazy detail that's up in this um like the columns and the, like the little ship and like his wings and it's just badass like i can't say anything more about it it's so good and then this is the newsletter yeah so we're gonna have to do that last so i did it first but you just heard my rant about SD cards. Um, Alright, so we got like a little twirly orange lollipop. I'm wondering if it's like creamsicle because it's like red or orange and white. What the fuck am I talking about red? Um, so, alright, we'll do the pin. So, this pin is awesome. It is a predator pin, just the head, and the detail on this is amazing. I don't know how you do detail on this, like something this tiny. It's just so small, but yeah, that's awesome. I love that. Love predator. And then the next thing that I grabbed, oh my god, I almost got a box is the invisible man magnet something else to go on my fridge to make it like more badass so really cool it's black and white that's the finish on this um and once again like completely like detailed up the butt <laughs> um so yeah like um his like cravat and and his like lapels are all like crossed and i just love like the like you can see his like wraps and everything so crazy detailed i love it um and then the next item is this and this is like the cthulhu wall plate i believe i'll have to go through the list and i'll give you a breakdown of what it actually <laughs> was um but i love the metallic blue color that he used on that i'm just a big fan of like see anything if you guys didn't know that but this is going up next to my seashell collection because i just feel like that's really appropriate god he's so good like with all the little like lines and stuff i'm such a noob with clay so like when i look at stuff like this i'm just like how do you do that <laughs> Um, all right, so I think, I hope I got everything that, oh my God, I did forget one thing. Okay, so I believe this is the last thing that was in the Cryptocurium Parcel of Terror, which is an alien, um, sticker in space. No one can hear you scream, ain't that the damn truth? Um, so yeah, this is going to be a magnet for my fridge. That's awesome. I think it'll look super good with all the rest of the stuff that I got as far as like sticker magnets. Anyways, let's get on with the list. This video isn't like 10,000 days long. I did not find the Bloody Jack, so there's that. Um, this month's parcel of terror includes the Kraken Wall Plaque, the final addition to our 
series of cryptozoology themed wall plaques depicts the tentacled horror from the depths cast in solid resin and individually hand painted comes with comes ready to display with detachable metal latch. I swear to God, I'm going to get better at like reading this cryptic stuff. Um, then the next item is the alien sticker, a recreation of the poster art in sticker form from the 1979 sci-fi horror masterpiece alien high quality pearl finish sticker. The next item is the Invisible Man Magnet, the seventh in our series of classic era monster magnets based on the Universal Films, available only through the Parcel of Terror, cast in solid resin, and individually hand painted in a silver screen black and white finish. Cthulhu Rises Print. The great old one awakens from his ancient slumber among the mind-bending pillars of the corpse city rail yeah sorry um brought to you by Cryptocurium's illust guest illustrator Ben Dodds printed on high quality gloss cardstock see more of Ben's works in his Etsy shop Slitzy's Oddities And then the next item is the Jungle Hunter pin, a trophy head of the ultimate trophy head hunter, cast in solid resin and individually hand painted, comes ready to wear with attached metal pin back. And that is my Cryptocarium Parcel of Terror January unboxing. Comment down below your favorite item that I got out of this Parcel of Terror. Mine is going to be kind of a tie between the wall plaque of Cthulhu and then the print of Cthulhu. Like, they're both... They're both really, really cool. I'm going to hang them next to each other, next to my seashells, because I think that's like kind of like themed, you know what I mean? Um, so let me know what you guys liked the best, and I will link Cryptocurium's website down below. Go buy some Parcel of Terror or individual items if you don't want to do Parcel of Terror, but um, you might want to if you are Halloween oriented at all because he's coming out with some Halloween stuff when it's not Halloween. So that is going to be my jam for sure. Um, and follow me on other social media. I follow back on all my links we posted down below and please like and subscribe and comment please hit the notification bell so you know when i upload thanks for watching guys bye